Emmy Kamani here folks and welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. What we're going to be doing in today's video is we're going to be reviewing all the words, idiomatic expressions, phrases that you can use in a conversation on the phone. So stay with me. When you've just called someone and you're talking to them, in English we say you are on the phone. So to be on the phone means to be talking to someone on the phone. It means you've made a phone call with someone and you're talking to them on the phone. So to be on the phone to someone. An example, please speak quietly. Emily is on the phone. Please speak quietly. Emily is on the phone, which means try to be a little bit more quiet because she's talking to someone on the phone. She's on the phone. All right, the second expression that you need to know is to be on the phone to someone. To be on the phone to someone. When you're on the phone to someone, it means you're talking to someone on the phone. So, to be on the phone to someone. An example, who is she on the phone to? Who is she on the phone to? Which means, who is she talking to on the phone? Who is she on the phone to? Which means, who is she talking to on the phone? Or, I hope you're not on the phone to my father. I hope you're not on the phone to my father, which means I hope you're not talking to my father on the phone. I hope you're not on the phone to my father. The third expression that you need to know is to get on the phone to someone. To get on the phone to someone. To get on the phone to someone. When you get on the phone to someone, you call them, you ring them, you give them a call. So, to get on the phone to someone, which means to call someone, to give someone a call. To get on the phone to someone. An example, don't you like to get on the phone to her and tell her what has happened? Don't you like to get on the phone to her and tell her what has happened? Which means, don't you want to call her, give her a call and tell her what has happened? So, don't you want to get on the phone to her and tell her what has happened? One more example, if you need any help, all you need to do is get on the phone to me. If you need any help, all you need to do is get on the phone to me, which means if you need any help, if you're in need of anything, any sort of help, all you need to do is just give me a call, get on the phone to me. All right, let's move on to the next expression that you can use on the phone, which is to speak or talk to someone on the phone. To speak or talk to someone on the phone, which means to call someone and talk to them on the phone. To speak and talk to someone on the phone. An example, I think you cannot solve this problem by talking to her on the phone. You have to talk to her in person. I do not think that you can solve the problem by talking to her on the phone. You need to talk to her in person. Which means you cannot solve this problem by calling her, giving her a call or talking to her on the phone. What you need to do is go and see her in person and talk to her about it in person to be able to solve this problem. So, I don't think you can solve this problem by talking to her on the phone. Alright, now let's move on to the next expression that you need to know about a phone call, which is the phone rings. The phone rings. When the phone rings, someone starts calling you or someone starts getting on the phone to you. So, when the phone rings, it means someone is on the phone, someone is calling you and someone wants to talk to you on the phone. So, the phone rings. An example, I think the phone is ringing, someone should go and answer the phone. I think someone is ringing, someone should go and answer the phone, which means I think someone is calling us, someone has given us a call, someone is on the phone to us. So, we got to go and answer the phone. All right, the next expression is to pick up or answer the phone. To pick up or answer the phone. When someone calls you, what you need to do in order to talk to them on the phone is answer the phone or pick up the phone. So, to answer or pick up the phone. An example, why is no one picking up the phone? Someone is calling us. Why is no one picking up the phone? Someone is calling us. Or, why is no one answering the phone? Someone is calling us. Which means, someone is calling us, giving us a call, and the phone is ringing, so someone should answer the phone or pick up the phone. All right, the next expression. When you talk to someone on the phone and when you're done with talking to someone on the phone, when your phone conversation with them comes to an end or is over, what you do is you put the phone down. All right, the next expression that you need to know is slam the phone down. 
Slam the phone down. Slam the phone down, which means to put the phone down on someone angrily in a way that shows you're angry with them. So to slam the phone down. When you slam the phone down on someone, it means you put the phone down on someone in an angry way, angrily. You know because you're angry with them because you know、uh, you've had a tough conversation with them on the phone or. You've had an argument with them on the phone, or something happened between you and them that got you angry or made you angry, and you no longer wanted to continue the phone conversation with them. So, to slam the phone down. An example: If you don't stop asking me personal questions, I'll slam the phone down. If you don't stop asking me personal questions, I'll slam the phone down. If you don't stop asking me personal questions, I'll slam the phone down. Which means, if you do not stop asking me personal questions, I'll put the phone down on you to show that I'm angry with you. So, if you don't stop asking me personal questions, if you do not bring an end to asking me personal questions, what I will do is slam the phone down, put the phone down on you, and stop the phone conversation with you. All right, now let's proceed to the next expression, which is someone is wanted. On the phone, someone is wanted on the phone. Someone is wanted on the phone. When someone is wanted on the phone, someone wants to talk to them on the phone. You, the phone rings. You pick up the phone. Someone starts talking to you on the phone. The person that you're talking to on the phone wants to talk to someone else that they mention on the phone. In this case, that person that they want to talk to on the phone that has been mentioned in the phone call is wanted. On the phone. So to be wanted on the phone. An example: Emily, you're wanted on the phone. Your dad wants to talk to you. Emily, you're wanted on the phone. Your dad wants to talk to you. Emily, you're wanted on the phone. Your dad wants to talk to you. Emily, you're wanted on the phone. Your dad wants to talk to you. Which means Emily, your dad. Which means Emily, your dad is requested to talk to you on the phone, or your dad wants to talk to you on the phone. So please come here and talk to your dad on the phone. You're wanted on the phone. All right, now we move on to the next expression, which is the phone goes dead, or the phone is dead. The phone goes or is dead, which means you're on the phone to someone. You're talking to them on the phone. Suddenly something happens. The line. Is disconnected and you can no longer talk to them on the phone because the line is bad or you cannot hear them well or there there's a technical problem there's an issue with the phone call something goes wrong you can no longer continue the conversation you cannot hear them clearly so the phone goes dead or the phone is dead which means the you know phone call doesn't work anymore which means the phone call you know cannot continue anymore or the phone. You know, stops working or faces a technical problem, which prevents you from continuing the conversation with someone on the phone. So the phone is dead, or the phone goes dead. An example: I couldn't continue the conversation because the phone went dead. I couldn't continue the conversation because the phone went dead. I could not continue the conversation because the phone went dead. Which means the reason why I could not keep talking to Emily on the phone is I, I could not hear her. Something went wrong. The phone stopped working. You know,、uh, a technical problem、uh, arose, and you know we could not continue the conversation on the phone. So the phone went dead. All right, now let's proceed to the next expression that you need to know when talking to someone on the phone or in a phone conversation, which is the phone is busy. Or engaged. In American English, we say the phone is busy, but in British English, you can also hear the expression of the phone is engaged as well. So the phone is busy, or the phone is engaged, which means someone is talking to someone else on the phone. Which is why their line is busy, and you cannot call them or talk to them. The the call is not connected because they're busy. The line is busy. So. We say the phone is busy or the phone is engaged, which means someone is talking to someone else on the phone, or someone is busy talking to someone else on the phone. An example: I can't call her now. The phone is busy. I can't call her now. The phone is busy, or I can't call her now. The phone is engaged.
in British English. I cannot call her now, the phone is engaged, which means it's not possible for me to talk to her on the phone or get on the phone to her because I think she's busy talking to someone else on the phone or her line is busy, so the phone is busy, the phone is engaged, I cannot talk to her. All right, now let's get to the last expression of today's video that you need to know while talking to someone on the phone or in a phone conversation, which is the phone is off the hook. The phone is off the hook. The phone is off the hook. Which means the phone cannot be used because it is not connected, it's not in the right place that it should be, or it's not dangling from you know the place that it should be dangling from, or it's not in the right place, or it cannot be used because it's not connected, or it's it's you know already been used, or it is not possible to use it. An example. I think uh, I'll get to call you later because the phone is off the hook. I'll get to call you later because the phone is off the hook. I'll get to call you later because the phone is off the hook. I'll get to call you later because the phone is off the hook, which means I cannot call you now. It's not possible for me to call you now because of a technical problem preventing me from getting on the phone to you. So I'm going to give you a call later. I'll get on the phone to you later. All right, guys, that's about all. That's about all that you need to know in a phone conversation with someone or when talking to someone on the phone. What I want you to do is subscribe to my YouTube channel if you enjoy watching my videos, like them as well, and leave a comment down below by making sentences out of the expressions that you learned by watching today's video. I'll be back soon.